<laughs> it was brilliant from Stokes, but as uh, you said, there were some less than brilliant moments from the Aussies. Let's just go through a few. This is Marcus Harrison. This is a tough catch. This is a tough catch. But you get that hand under it, you expect to take it when you're a Test match player. Outfielders have to take them. It's an error in baseball. It, it, it's a big opportunity for Australia to win the game. Uh, Marcus got there and it, he spilled it. Error. Yeah, well, that's first error, as you see there, that catch. And at that point, we still thought yeah. there's, going to be, there's going to be time, there's going to be moments. There were moments we could have done it. This, perhaps, is Nathan Lyon's personal nightmare. This is the run at opportunity. Pat Cummins throws it in, slowish. Oh. Oh, we had the... They were all <laughs> celebrating. They all thought they had that. Oh. that. I mean, that's just pressure, isn't it? That is Ash's pressure yeah. summed up there in one moment. Well, it was going to be the run out of, of uh, Alan Donald in the World Cup. We, we were going to have the photo, weren't we, of all the players rushing to the pitch. But as Kerry said, he just had a peep at the batsman, Kerry, yeah. at the wrong time. And Herschel Gibbs texted him, said, I have closure. <laughs> 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 and Neville Glover cheered. <laughs> uh, exactly. What well, didn't end there, though, did it? Those miserable times for Australia. Uh, did, we didn't get our video reviews right. Cost us dearly in the end. They went upstairs for this one. Un who knows why? That was a shocker. Who knows why? That was never going to be out. Never. And that, of course, left them with absolutely nothing in the tank. Now, Tim Payne, he admitted, Crash, that he's got these wrong all along. Mm. Yeah, oh. and, and look, he chatted to the bowler, but they, they just... Throughout the entire series, they, they've been this poor is... with reviews. And then the world's that worst was test umpire, Joel, was, that was, was gives that not out. I, I actually believe that decision was closer than it looked. Uh, and that hits oh. his front pad and then rebounds to his back pad. I'm not saying that's plum. Uh, oh. Joel Wilson is a very poor umpire. To me, he guesses his way through. But that, Kerry, to me, many disagree, but I reckon that was a slightly harder decision than what it looked. Imagine Joel Wilson and Jack Leash saying, we'll see you to the door. You never <laughs> get that. <laughs> <laughs> and, I mean, for Ben Stokes, no matter how superhuman he is, he's sort of, you know, got the whole Steve Smith about him, that, that's, that Superman element. Yeah. Geez, lucky. When you look back, Kerry, at that World Cup final and the bat of God oh, yeah. and then that LB call, yeah. 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 He's, he's the lucky man oh, at the look, moment. Unfortunately, the, the reviewing is now a tactic and, and, mm. and teams will have to look at... That's why they were mentally disintegrating Australia. I mean, the LBW against Jack Leach, that... That would have been umpire's call if the wickets had been a Sulo bin. <laughs> but Tim Payne managed to go upstairs because he was mentally... This is our last chance. Yep. Yeah. Teams will now reassess. There's still chances well, there's still. That. I'm not sure if it's too late to lodge a protest now because even the DRS had the original decision as out. Look, have another look. See the original decision <laughs> out. Yes. The decision out, That's good enough. I mean, somebody yeah. break out the champagne. We've won the ashes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We won the thing. <laughs> that's not... Doctor, that's exactly no, how, that's it, came how it came out. That's how it came out. Four yeah. reds, that's out. <laughs> but he stayed in. And you're all flat Stanleys here, but I, I don't know if I'm alone, but the Test cricket needed this, didn't it? It needed oh, the yeah. series to remain alive. Two more to come. We've got footy finals around the corner. We're set for the biggest month Kel, in sport in a long what time. What if we lose, Kel? Yeah, yeah. That's the thing, but how do they come back from this? That, that's mm. the bigger issue. For, yep. To get so close and to, to almost drop the ashes on four occasions, and now get their confidence up, their belief up. They were gone. Yeah. England was shot. And you can see in the body language, I mean, Nathan Lyon, he was understandably devastated. This is him after the result. Kerry, he's an important cog in the Australian bowling wheel. How does he come back from yeah. that? Yeah. It's great Well, shot. he will, because there's a strength to Nathan Lyon, but he feels that because he, he's a guy that prides I don't make errors, and that was, a, that was a big mistake, missing that run out. Look, he's such an interesting study because his self-esteem has skyrocketed the last two years, mm. but beneath it, there's a layer of fragility. Look, he's a tough kid, but he's also very sensitive, Kerry, isn't Absolutely. he? Like, he, he is. will be struggling to sleep at night, all those sort of things. But I felt Tim Payne missed having a Stephen Smith there in the field. Mm -hmm. Just that senior general saying, no, no, no review, mate, no. You know, just mm -hmm. no one. He was very alone, Kerry. Oh, he? he was indeed. And, and that was because of Ben Stokes again. Yeah. I mean, he just basically disintegrated him. The thing with Nathan Lyon, too, is that he, he went into the series thinking, I own Ben Stokes. He won't hit across my line. He won't hit me downtown. He'll never reverse sweep me. He's done all of it in that innings. So the matchup, B Stokes v N Lyon, I'm a little bit on B Stokes in the remaining two tests.